the first thing we need to do is gather some uh, sources into geospatial analysis. So someone has given me uh, s shape files for some state boundaries. They've also given me a spreadsheet that shows uh, extra information right there that I want to be able to um, append to the shape, shape file data. So the first thing I need to do is go to Feature Sources and add uh, shape files. You can see that we could also add a small VMDS data set, but in this case um, the regions that I had were not part of a VMDS database. So I add that and choose this shape file. Say next, and we know what coordinate system it's in. We will um, generate the business objects, and we will call the feature source um, uh, states. Then we also have to get a feature source from the um, spreadsheet. So say Microsoft Excel. There's the extra info. Call it extra info. So if I zoom in here, um, so those are the states that we're, 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 we're going to use. Um, I need to make a business collection. So these are the business collections or tables, um, but I want to make a new one that has these two combined. So I can say um, add a collection, and the source will be uh, from the uh, shapefile. And we can call it state combined data and then we configure it say the state combined file um, in data file um, combines that and we will join it to the spreadsheet it'll be a lookup table and we will join it based on the record number so we go record number on the shape file it should equal the record number in the spreadsheet. So there we have it. So we can go to this uh, combined data now. We can right click and say browse the collection. And you can see it has information about the record number, it has the shape, and if we uh, scroll over it also has information on the right hand side from the spreadsheet such as, well, has the record number again. We can uh, clear that up later. It has residential customers and uh, some transformer information for each region, some transformer summary information. So one way to clean that up would be to go um, so that here these are the fields that are output for state combined data and we say we don't want the second record number. attributes. And we can say uh, remove. We'll go back here and browse again. You can see the table um, just contains the columns that we're really interested in. In the next, um, the, the following videos, I will show uh, two use case scenarios and I will show how to uh, export the results or how to do an analysis, create a thematic map, uh, plot the results, do a report, and exp export to Excel for both of those scenarios.